Everyone loves Keanu Reeves, some of us more than others. From Winona Ryder to Kelly Ripa, here are the celebs that really want to date the man. Just look at Sandra Bullock. I would have to say probably Keanu Reeves. Really? Mm -hmm. Good one. All right. Bullock came for an interview with Ellen DeGeneres on the famous Ellen Show. And as Ellen is notorious for pulling up old memories and asking celebs to explain, she did the same with Bullock. Ellen pulled out a picture of Bullock and Reeves on the set of their 1994 blockbuster, Speed. That kind of launched your career, right? It, oh, it most definitely did. It was I meant think, for me and you sweet. took the role. The actress admitted that this was the movie that put her on the map. She also revealed some details about how it was on set with her co-star. Her gorgeous co-star, might I add. Anyway, Bullock took a trip down memory lane, recalling how handsome Keanu looked when the two were filming Speed together. She even claimed that every time he looked at her, even during filming serious scenes, she would just start giggling. Hey, I get it. I would too. He was, it yeah. was hard. It was really, yeah. it was hard for me to like really be serious. Like he would look at me and I'd be like. <laughs> when Ellen asked if they ever got together, Bullock says no. And she gives a reason too. She says that it's probably because there's something about her that he didn't like. I mean, that can't be true. Just look at her. And well, she was wrong. While filming, Keanu revealed to Ellen that he too had a crush on Sandra. No. Yeah. Did she, did she, did you she have obviously didn't know I had a crush on her either. Oh. Unfortunately for them and fans who adored the two actors, Keanu and Sandra never got to date. But that's okay. According to Bullock, the reason they're still friends is because they didn't get together back then. Which I guess is fair enough. I'm glad she feels that way. But not all celebs do. Take Kelly Ripa for example. In a recent interview on her own morning show, Ripa called Keanu Reeves for a talk in a behind the scenes video. It was revealed that Ripa told the actor that she had a huge crush on him. And what she said was graphic. The Matrix actor was caught quite off guard, as the host admitted to having once made out with a cardboard cutout of him. Yep, that's right. If you ask me, doing it is one thing. But what's worse is that she admitted to it. Of course, that confession led to a series of background questions, which Ripa answered graciously. She said that she had seen this cutout at Blockbuster, where her friend was working at the time. Ripa told her friend to hand it to her when she was done. And when she was done, Ripa kept the life-size cutout in her dressing room, of all places, while she was on the set of All My Children. But her admission to this wasn't even the worst part. She literally told him that sometimes she would have her way with it there. I mean, isn't that a bit too on the nose? All is well though. Reeves handled it with humility and humor. That's why we all love him, right? <laughs> I think, I, I mean, there's the day-to-day -day stuff sometimes, like traffic! But we're clearly not the only only ones who love him. Suki Waterhouse has the same view. Uh, Keanu. I'll say Keanu, yeah. yeah. He's yeah. like the best looking 50 year old man. Totally. And he's not anybody's stepdad or anything, no. I, don't, I don't think. Actor and model Suki Waterhouse may be way younger than Reeves, but that doesn't mean she can't like him. Back in 2016, Waterhouse starred in a movie called The Bad Batch. Her co-stars were quite the attraction, Keanu Reeves and Jason Momoa. During a promo interview with Young Hollywood, the actress was asked about her co-stars. The host asked who she would pick out of the two men, personally. After shying away at first, Waterhouse said that she couldn't pick Momoa because he was her best friend's stepfather, which I have to say is a little weird. So she picked Reeves, but she didn't just pick by default. She seemed quite happy with her choice and the fact that he wasn't anybody's stepfather. In fact, the actress was praising Reeves just a few moments ago. In the movie, he plays the role of a man called The Dream. It feeds you few things in this world operate like that. Waterhouse revealed that she and the film's director, Anna Lily Armapour, even talked about it. She said that she asked Lily why he was cast as the dream, to which she responded that he was the dream. I can't disagree. He really is the dream. Even Octavia Spencer seems to think so. Keanu Reeves has had a long and eventful career, so accordingly, he has many stories about him that have become infamous. One of those stories is the one involving Hollywood's sweetheart, Octavia Spencer. It's one where the actor helped her out when her car broke down on the side of the road. I mean, what a gentleman. Is there nothing he does wrong? Spencer spoke about this in an interview with Meredith Vieira. During the interview, the actress claimed that her car looked terrible, and so did she. But she said that Reeves was more than happy to help her out with the situation. Then the host started making small 
innuendos about her story with Reeves, and Spencer was blushing all over. She was so subtle and adorable about it. When I say I was looking foul, <laughs> I don't want that memory to come back. But you know who wasn't that subtle about their intentions with Reeves? Winona Ryder. I'm sure most of you have seen or remember any part of the 1992 film Dracula, the one starring Ryder and Reeves. If you do remember, there was a very authentic looking wedding scene in the movie. And apparently, it was too authentic for Ryder. In true fangirl fashion, Ryder actually imagined that she was married to the Matrix actor. I would too if I were in her position. Anyway, in a promo interview for their fourth movie together, The Destination Wedding. Carry me, please. What? This is the slowest I've ever been carried. God, you gotta be quiet. Ryder and Reeves appeared for an interview with Entertainment Today. During the interview, Ryder claimed that her co-star was the best for every reason. She said that he's one of her favorite people to work around, as well to be around. Imagine it with doing, doing it with anybody else. Him. The interview was quite wholesome though, as Reeves revealed that he felt the same way toward Ryder. It's not just the female celebs of Hollywood that are crazy about Reeves. Guys aren't immune to his charm either. In fact, Jonathan Groff has nothing but good things to say. While Jonathan Groff might not have particularly wanted to date Keanu Reeves, he did lust after him when the two were filming The Matrix Resurrections. You can have him on here for Trinity. That's the trouble. He knew you'd come just like I did. Groff talked about it during a promotional interview for the new film on Drew Barrymore's show. He talked about his experience preparing with Keanu for their combat scene in the film. Drew claimed that she liked to think Keanu looked really hot, and Groff didn't just not disagree. In fact, he went on and on about it. He said that Reeves was super hot and crazy hot, adding that his looks were just next level. While Jonathan had no problem crushing on his co-star, Drew felt just a little awkward because she had once worked on a film with him when she was very young. Either way, Groff was right, and no one can disagree with that. Though Groff just had a little crush on Reeves, not particularly wanting to date him, the same can't be said about Paula Abdul. Back in the day, Abdul and Reeves made a music video together, and many speculated that they had something going on between them. Clearly, those speculations didn't just die out with time. It was brought up again, years later. Abdul had come for an interview on Watch What Happens Live with Andy Cohen, and an audience member asked her if she and the actor ever went on a date. And Abdul said the exact same thing all the celebs have been thinking. She wishes. She continued by describing how she managed to walk in on him attempting to play air guitar in his underwear in his trailer. I mean, that must have been quite the sight. She admitted to thinking that she wanted him to be her boyfriend, but it never happened for the two stars. That was our list of all the celebs who have crushed over Keanu Reeves. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.